If you don't like chicken breast, it's because you never taste this recipe. Let's start by cutting two chicken breasts in the half to make some fillets. Here I'm gonna cut only in the half because my chicken breast is thin, but if you have a thick, you can make more fillets. It's gonna be like this and I'm gonna repeat the process with the other chicken breast, just like this. After this done, I'm gonna season it with salt to taste. Let's pour some salt on top of each fillet just like this. And also, I'm gonna add black pepper. The quantity is to taste. It will depend on the size of your chicken breast. I'm gonna spread all over the chicken fillets and then season the other side. Here I have my chicken fillets well seasoned, I'm gonna put in wheat flour. The quantity is to taste. Let's cover all the fillets with this flour. And I'm gonna repeat this process with all the chicken breasts. Guys, prepare this recipe at home and I'm sure everyone will love it. You won't regret. Now guys, let's put these chicken fillets in a frying pan with one tablespoon of butter. I'm gonna add it just like this. And I'm gonna fry it three by three, just like this. Let's add the last one. And now let's fry it for a couple of minutes until it's golden brown. And now we just have to turn it just like this. And look, it's golden brown. We're gonna flip them and let it fry until it's golden brown both sides. It's really easy. And here, guys, our chicken breast is golden brown both sides. Now let's add one teaspoon of butter. And also two minced garlic cloves. And let's fry it for two minutes. After this time, let's add one tablespoon of white vinegar, one tablespoon of soy sauce, and one tablespoon of honey. This is gonna be our special sauce. Now we are gonna fry this chicken for about two minutes. One minute one side, then let's turn it and let's fry the other side. And look at the color of this chicken. Guys, this recipe is simply amazing. Prepare it at home and I'm sure everyone will love it. Now to give a special touch, I'm gonna add cilantro to taste. And that's it, guys. Now we just have to enjoy this amazing recipe. Prepare this recipe at home and I'm sure everyone will love it. Thank you for watching our videos and for following our recipes. It's a pleasure having you all here with us. Hope you enjoyed this recipe and I see you in the next one. Bye-bye!